effect of parallel apoptic and spherical shapes dimensions on convective drying characteristics of sweet potato by oba kondia honor ganame abdul salam and zugmo franco is the aim of this work is to determine the characteristic dimension gunning transfers during convective drying parallel apoptic and cylindrical form of sweet potato was used This present work determines this characteristic dimension for the samples of sweet potatoes of parallel apipedal and cubic shapes. We have fixed the characteristic dimension in the direction of the thickness of the samples of parallel apipedal shape and of the radius for the samples of cylindrical shape. For the parallel apipedic form PLLE, the thickness C is set to 1 cm while the length L and the width L vary. The results show that the variation of the dimensions other than the thickness e does not influence the transfers in a considerable way. The same observation is made for the cylindrical samples C H R by keeping the radius R constant. From the foregoing, the thickness of the parallel pipe samples turns out to be the dimension that best governs the transfers versus its length and width. Likewise with regard to cylindrical samples the fixed radius smaller than the height is the characteristic dimension of the transfers in the product during its convective drying If we know that the initial size is an important factor for transfers during convective drying Woba 2013 This present work therefore allows us to conclude that the thickness of the parallel pipe shaped samples and the radius of the cylindrical shapes all being the smallest dimensions characterize the transfers this work highlights the importance and the existence of a characteristic dimension that dictated the transfers during the convective drying of organic products such as sweet potatoes Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe our channel for watch more scientific research videos.